Hey, it's John and Mike, brew-shoots.com, and we're giving an update on the community brew that we put together, oh, I don't know, probably about a month ago. Now, it was back in May that we were outside brewing live on YouTube and elsewhere, and uh, the fruit of our labor is, uh, is right here in front of us, and I thought I'd give an update on just the general community swap, as uh, it turned out. Uh, over 20, 25 brewers contacted us and wanted to be a part of this. They sent over their addresses. They uh, even gave phone numbers for uh, particular shipping needs and uh, was able to match people up based on where they were uh, in, the, in the world. Uh, so it was kind of like this, it wasn't, it wasn't pairing, but a grouping of three home brewers where you would be able to send out two and get two back from uh, the two brewers that you were shipping to or shipping out to. Um, five countries represented in the community brew, including the Netherlands, Norway, UK, Australia, and of course, the United States of America. Um, I don't remember the number of states, but uh, the Northeast was uh, very well represented. Oh, good to yeah, know. That's very good to know. Uh, only a few from the West Coast. Um, maybe because, I don't know, they don't want to... They don't want to swap with us. They don't believe in us. They don't believe. I don't know. That's, we're just being funny. But um, a guy from Texas, guy from Missouri who we've swapped with before. Uh, I think uh, Tennessee, West Virginia, um, you know, a lot of New York, a lot of Massachusetts. Trying to think of other ones too. Sweet. But, uh, yeah, good uh, representation of uh, the country. And uh, it's nice to get everybody uh, involved in it and you know lots of thank yous in terms of hey thanks for setting this up I've always wanted to swap home brews with other people and this is a great place to do it so everyone has their shipping assignments hopefully they're getting in touch with each other to figure out uh, when, yes when they're shipping things out I shipped out my first bottle earlier this week um, so you have your assignments in which I have to <laughs> mine is carbonated I'll just have to bottle it up and tell you it'll go tell you who you're shipping to as well. And then there's um, a few other people who we've, we've uh, gotten in contact with over the years, or probably the year, since we have been taking uh, people, you know, shipping us home brews for just tasting and talking on camera about, and I'm gonna ship those across to them. Like I'm just, you know, they have other beers that they wanna swap. They're not part, they didn't brew the same recipe but uh, I'm going to swap with them and just you know keep that swap and vibe going. So this is the best bitter that we brewed. Um, I think it's okay. I don't still don't think I, I hit everything I wanted to hit with it, but I think it's still fairly tasty and uh, easy drinking for sure. I mean, I, I, I had a few bottles uh, uh, earlier this week, <laughs> but... Um, you know, this weekend was was a pretty good. It was a hot weekend, so it was nice to have these in the fridge, and uh, they definitely were pretty good lawnmower beers after working outside. So lawnmower beer with some character, though. Mm. So that's good. Mm. It's not as uh, light as uh, other lawnmower beers that we brewed in the in the past, but uh, it's a nice drinking one, man, and, and uh, not not too uh, not too high on the old ABV, um, but you know it's it's nice. So I hope to get a lot of people's notes back from uh, brews that they've swapped and taste. And uh, if, if someone has something exceptional, uh, please share it with us so you know we can all learn from maybe they did something a little bit different than everybody else yes. that, uh, that got that, uh, that beer to uh, escalate itself to its uh, uh, a level of excellency, not just good beer. So that's so, all. So after we feel like everyone's had a chance to ship and we get mm -hmm. a sense that shipping has sort of ended, completed <laughs> ended. Uh, yeah. we'll do another video yeah. we'll do a side-by-side -side yeah. of our beer on yeah. camera and then that'll be a place where people can then leave comments yeah. on what their experience was with their swappy that, that actually makes a lot of sense yeah right. i was going to definitely like poll people like hey uh, yeah. just to, to share notes and stuff because yeah. we can also do that too like if you write to us and say like tasted so-and-so's beer here are my notes. Um, we can certainly read those and share yeah. those and, and bring this community brew, brew experiment to its final end. Yeah. Bring it together. Yes, the whole closure of it. I think that's what we need. 
So that's the update. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, appreciate the uh, time. Please subscribe if you like this kind of stuff. We hope to put a video out every week for the rest of our lives. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, big commitment there. So anyway, for John and Mike, BrewDashDudes.com. Brew on. Cheers. Cheers.